Hey everyone, DW Berman here with a, another graphics video tip thing. This time it's with Premiere. Now the one one quirk with Premiere is uh, dealing with the multiple tracks of audio. Once you drag a clip into Premiere and it has a channel on the left and uh, no audio on the right, or you have a multi-track thing and uh, you just can't pick which track you want to use. Uh, there, you actually can. Uh, there are a few ways to do it. Uh, one is over here in the project window. If you just right click on it, go to modify audio channels, you have your uh, ability here to switch it from stereo into mono. So if you have two tracks that you want, uh, say you have, uh, you're doing an interview and you have the interviewer on track one and interviewee on track two, Instead of having a stereo track, you would want to have two mono tracks, and I just exited out of that. So uh, in this case, you want two audio tracks, one with channel, well, yeah, left and right. And then when you bring it into the timeline, it is split into two tracks. Now, uh, unfortunately, once it's in the timeline, you can't really do that very well. However, you can... Um, if you only need the audio in one track, you can right click and go to um, what is it? audio channels and you can select which track you want to use. Uh, again, we can't change the format now, but we can select which track is used. And if we use the same track in our case, the left one has audio on it and the right one does not. We just need uh, to check the left for both. And then boom, we have mirrored audio tracks. Now there are other ways of doing this too. Uh, let's go to, uh, let's undo that. I'll just undo it. Ah, how about that? Uh, there's also a uh, effect for this, audio effect. Uh, I think there should be a right to left or left to right. Yeah, fill right with left. Nope, fill left with right. Nope, right with left. There we go. And that should take care of our audio problem. Uh, they translate. Uh, yep, yep, that did that. Um, if you want to do it on an entire track, you can actually do that. It's uh, not super obvious, but if you go up to the window and we uh, load in the... Or works... No, we don't want workspace. We just want to see which window. Where is our audio window? Audio track mixer. This is not obvious, but there's a, a little pull down up top here. The show effects and sends. If we open that up, we can say, oh, on uh, track A2, let's... Uh, add an effect and the effect can be the left right if I can find it oh, fill left with right so there you go we have an effect applied to an entire track of audio so now every any audio bit you have in there is going to have that applied so those are a few ways of uh, of taking care of the audio track mixing issue again if you want to separate the tracks it's, uh, you almost I don't know if there's a good way to do that within the uh, track editor itself or within the the timeline but if you go to the project and you interpret the 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 footage you can have separate mono tracks for the left and the right so hopefully that helps someone out there because it's a uh, it's not an obvious thing and it's uh, something that you're likely to run into if you're dealing with footage uh, from cameras and stuff so thanks for watching uh, like the video uh, subscribe to the channel and if you want to see more Premiere tips and tricks, uh, leave a comment and let me know. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.